Now let's talk a little bit about education and health. Do you know about one in four adults in America are diagnosed with bipolar? And what is bipolar? There's a lot of misdiagnosis, misconception, overdiagnosis. As far as bipolar is concerned, people just throw around words and say this and that. But you can't really blame them because there is a lot of interchangeable symptoms related with other diagnoses and comorbidities and right so bipolar is characterized by mania episodes and depressive episodes they last for days weeks or months and sometimes without the manic episode providers might miss it or you haven't had a manic episode, so it might not be bipolar. All right? Now, ADHD and anxiety sometimes is also being diagnosed as bipolar. But people with ADHD most often present with anxiety, with depression, and with bipolar. They walk hand in hand. Now, bipolar is also sometimes misdiagnosed for borderline personality disorder. But borderline personality disorder is characterized by extreme fear of abandonment, issues with social relationships. You want to be happy, you don't know how to be happy. Extreme fear of abandonment, impositivity. You also see that you see some presentation of impulsivity when it comes to ADHD. So it can be a little bit confusing. So to help your provider narrow down on exactly what you're presenting with so you can get the right medication is to tell them exactly how you feel, good or bad. Whether you're feeling great or you're not feeling great, your provider needs to have a full, complete picture of what your presentations are, what your symptoms are. And when they do get a diagnosis, if you question it, ask them to explain. If they are unsure, it's okay for you to seek a second opinion. Very important, so that you get the right treatment. And you're not being treated based on guesswork. It's okay for you to seek a second opinion. Don't feel bad that, oh, I don't want to provide No, it's about your health and getting the right treatment is very important. I hope this information helps somebody. All right? I don't know. We'll meet again. Thank you. Stay tuned.